Mass Math, Albert Keeps Score, by Daphne Skinner, illustrated by Deborah Melman, read by Nicole Gos. Albert, Wanda, said Mom. Time to get up. Wanda didn't even open her eyes. Five more minutes, Mom, she asked. Please? All right, Miss Sleepyhead, said her mother. If she gets five minutes, can I get five minutes too? Albert asked. Five it is, said Mom. Wanda, five. Albert, five. A minute later, a wonderful smell drifted in. Wanda and Albert scurried to the kitchen table. Yum, said Wanda. Roasted pumpkin seeds. How come she has more seeds than I do? Asked Albert. I want the same as Wanda. Aren't two enough for you? Asked Mom. If she gets three, I get three, he said. That's fair. Wanda, three. Albert, three. After school, Wanda fed her plants, and Albert fed his fish. Wanda set the table, and Albert put away his toys. She does two jobs, and I do two jobs. Wanda, two. Albert, two. Time for some cheese doodles, said Wanda. How many are you having? asked Albert. I don't know, three or four, said Wanda. If you eat three, I eat three, said Albert. But, he added, if you eat four, I eat four. Fine with me, said Wanda. She ate four and Albert ate four. Wanda, four, Albert, four. Later that day, Wanda had a tea party with Lucy, Taffy, and Melody. They all wore their fanciest outfits and had a wonderful time. I want a tea party too, said Albert. Really? said Mom. Who would you like to invite? Leo and Fred and, um, Grandpa Andy. I'm not sure Grandpa Andy likes tea parties, said Mom. Wanda invited three, said Albert, so I should invite three. I guess that's fair, said his mother. Leo, Fred, and Grandpa Andy came to Albert's party. Everybody had a really good time. Wanda, three. Albert, three. The next day, the family went to the library. Wanda got four books, and Albert got four books. Can I get another one? asked Wanda. Pretty please, with cheese on top? If she gets five books, I get five books, Albert said quickly. Four books each is enough for today, said Dad. Wanda, four. Albert, four. The next day, Albert and Wanda met their friends after school. They decided to play pirates. They had a sea battle and a sword fight. And then Wanda shouted, Let's walk the plank! Scary! I'll go first, Wanda cried, leaping high in the air. But when she landed, she squeaked in pain. Eek! Splinter! That was the end of the game. Albert helped Wanda limp home. Mom took out the splinter very, very carefully. Then she gave Wanda a whole peanut butter chip for being brave. Albert didn't ask, but she gave him one too. Wanda won. Albert won. Thanks for helping Wanda today, Mom said at bedtime. She got a really big splinter, said Albert. Yes, she did, said his mother. Did you want a really big splinter too? The same as Wanda's? No, said Albert. Not even a little splinter. Just checking, she said, and kissed him goodnight. Wanda one, Albert zero. You were very brave when I took out your splinter, Mom said to Wanda. Thanks, Mom, Wanda said. Mom leaned over and gave her a kiss. Can I have one more? asked Wanda. What do you think? Mom asked Albert. Albert thought about Wanda and her splinter. Yes, he said. She can. And Mom gave Wanda one more kiss. Wanda, two. Albert, one.